Deported four times, now he's back in Nashville and in custody. And we're learning this is the same man who was recently shot by an ICE agent. News Channel 5's Matthew Torres is live outside the attorney's office where he was arrested. Matthew, this man pleaded guilty to domestic assault in 2013. Vicky, that's right, domestic assault, and he also pleaded guilty to impersonating a Metro police officer that same year. He was also charged with child abuse. Federal officials say this guy has a laundry list of crimes. We now know his name is Jose Andrade Sanchez, the same man shot by an ICE agent earlier this month. And we learned from sources today that he was here at a law firm talking to an attorney before he was arrested. And, and as soon as he walked out of the office right here, he was, uh, there were some uh, federal agencies, he, agents here waiting for him. So he got arrested right here outside in our parking lot. Elizabeth Osment of Osment Law says there's never been an incident like this since the firm began in 1999. But this afternoon, members of ICE's Homeland Security Investigations were here to arrest Andrade Sanchez, an undocumented immigrant from Mexico who had been deported from the U.S. four times. Witnesses say they had their guns out when he stepped out of the building. He's been federally indicted for unlawful re-entry. This indictment came down six days after he was shot by an ICE agent while driving away in a box truck and then surrendering to the FBI. Osman fears this would prevent people from wanting to speak to an attorney. But the fact that it happened outside an attorney's office is what is, is you know, not right. It, said, it just doesn't seem right to me. Osman says the firm is looking to determine if anyone's rights were violated. She believes authorities had a warrant but isn't clear if this was the right approach to arrest the suspect. Reporting live in Nashville tonight, Matthew Torres, News Channel 5.